now with our Secrets of Secondhand Shopping series. A recent report finds the secondhand market is projected to grow to $77 billion wow. by 2025. That is more than double just two years ago, Robin. And this morning, we are finding furniture. Ike Ajachi joins us now from outside of Boston, Massachusetts. Great to see you, Ike. What'd you find? Good morning, Rebecca. We are right here at the Blessing Barn. It's a massive multi-story secondhand shop that's full of new and used items, decor, furniture, and of course, a pair of sister thrifters that show me how to find those hidden gems. Low on funds for furniture? Don't fret, says thrift store creative director Christy Morace and salesperson Elise Coy. The Blessing Barn in Menden, Massachusetts has four floors of furnishings at bargain basement prices. We have a couple great examples of mid-century uh, pieces here. Uh, this beautiful hutch and these pendant lights. And the beautiful thing about a thrift store is that you have genuine original mid-century pieces. And look at this, this pendant lamp, it's only $75. Fall semester's coming up. People are gonna have to yeah. fill their dorm rooms with something. So what do you have here? So we've got this really great wool rug, which is cool for personalizing your space. And this chair, which is awesome because it actually folds up. So if you have a small room, it's perfect for that. And this is really awesome because it actually opens. This would run you about $1,160 new. Our price, $399. Everyone needs storage. Absolutely. What can we find here at the Blessing Barn? Dressers with drawers or cabinets like this one. A piece like this is fantastic because it can be used in the bedroom for clothes or you can bring it in the kitchen as an island. And it's a good project if you want to refinish it yourself. Cost at a big box store? About $2,400 at the low end. Our bill? Just $545. And as for tips on stretching that dollar. If you have a budget in mind, you can always um, chat with the person that's working there and see if there's um, they can give you a deal. Don't be afraid to negotiate the price and check the sturdiness of used furniture and open all drawers and cabinets to make sure you're aware of their condition. Now, many of these shops are always trying to clear space to make way for new items. So if you tell the shop that you're willing to take away some of the big items that same day, it's likely they'll give you a little extra discount. Rebecca? Oh, we love that extra discount, Ike. Thank you so much. And you know, I love this kind of shopping because you don't have to build the furniture, mm, Robin. Yes. <laughs> Having it ready to go, right. take it away. Ikea. Yeah. Ikea. Yeah. Ikea. Exactly. Building. You know building. me too well, mm -hmm. Robin. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.